Wow, look at this beautiful picture right here. I hope you to understand up to this point. That's right. Electrons moving through what? That's right. The highway, which is we call circuit. Okay. What about inside? Inside, electron cannot move. So only this anions keep moving towards, which is sulfate. Next time, you're going to be the one who's going to get the Nobel Prize. That's right. Also, let me talk about SRP and SOP. Aha. Uh -huh. So, which is standard reduction potential. Okay. So, the bottom one, so standard oxidation potential. You can use either one. Okay. Uh, only difference is the positive and negative. Okay. That's the potential number wise the same. I'm going to use standard oxidation potential, okay? Which is for zinc, all metals, they have a potential, okay? But, okay, zinc has 0 0.76 volts. That's it. Copper, this one has 0 0.34 volts. But, this one going to be negative. Actually, absolute difference between these two potentials, which is 0.76 minus minus 0.34, which is 1.1. That's what we call E, okay, zero power. That's it. So that's a total potential, which is 1.1 volts. Right, you can see SRP list and SOP list, okay? I use the SOP, but left hand side, look at this zinc. Okay, zinc, oh, that's right. 0 0.76 uh, but that's negative right okay but the right hand side which is sop okay zinc is a positive 7 uh, 0 0.76 look at this uh, hydrogen oh hydrogen has zero potential okay no potential okay what if i use oh that's right maybe uh potassium wow that's 2.93 uh what about calcium 2.87 what if i used calcium and copper uh-huh then automatically so 2.87 minus minus means plus right okay so minus okay negative uh 0 0.34 okay so negative 0 0.34 that's it that's gonna be positive anyway so this is gonna be one this is gonna be two then Three. Oh, 3.21 volts. Okay, things like that. Okay, back to this. Okay, so we call this one one cell, right? So one cell like a battery. But, so this one, so we call voltaic. Oh, that's right. So voltaic cell. Also, galvanic cell because uh, we uh, follow the name of this inventor's name, which is galvani. So on this one, do you see the problem? Uh-huh. What if we have no light bulb? Just like this, no light bulbs. Okay, that means, oh, wait a minute. But the problem is, okay, as long as we have sulfuric acid like this, this one keeps eating this zinc, right? That means until this one's run out. Wait a minute. Then automatically new ideas came out. Okay, so we are using same sulfate, but hey, we're going to use zinc sulfate. How about that? Oh, that's right. Okay, zinc sulfate, just like this. Instead of that acid, hydrogen sulfate. So we're going to have same spectator. Let's look at this one. Zinc plus sulfuric acid, right? Okay, zinc. Oh, that's right. Regular atom, metal. That's why this one is solid, right? Everybody knows this one, solid. Okay, what about... Oh, hydrogen cation, which is cation, that's aqueous, right? Which is in water, okay, solution. Okay, what about this one? Oh, that's aqueous too, okay? So this one is uh, anions, okay, this one is a cations, right? Left hand side. Now, all of a sudden, oh, they exchanged, right? So hydrogen gas right here, okay, just like this. And 
zinc sulfate, right? Okay, zinc sulfate. Just like this. Now, you watch this one, okay? So, hydrogen, that was aqueous, now gas, right? Oh, just like this one. What about zinc? This zinc was solid. Now, this one is a positive to cation, which is what? Aqueous, that's right, it's in solution. Now, what about, oh, sulfate? Sulfate, negative two, negative two right here, left-hand side, right-hand side. Oh, aqueous to aqueous. That means, oh, oh, wait a minute. Only thing not changed is a sulfate. That's why SO4, so we call spectator. That's right. This one is a very, very interesting anions. Also, spectators now, okay, not many. Uh, maybe you can remember just the six cations, spectators, then uh, six anion spectators. Very easy. This is it. If you want, hey, you can remember everything right here, the right hand side. But you don't have to, okay? Uh, like uh, rubidium and strontium and iodide, oh, no big deal. So if you want, okay, you can just remember this one, okay? So left hand side, look at that, okay? Cations, this is a common spectators. Okay, lithium, sodium, potassium, barium. Oh, easy to remember, right? The right hand side, okay, anions, which is a chloride, bromide, and nitrate, and sulfate. That's it. So another problem is this one. Okay, we use zinc sulfate right here. Okay, good for zinc. What about this copper side? Oh, that is the problem, right? Okay, that's why the right hand side. Okay, this one is a Cu, which is a copper. So we're going to use copper sulfate. Oh man, that's it. That's right. On the left hand side, oxidation going on. Oh, that's right. But these electrons, oh, nowhere to go. So we connected this one, okay? Let's connect. But another problem is this one, okay? So we have to have extra boy left over right here, right? That means we're gonna send this one away, okay? Which is a sulfate anions. Then we're gonna send this, okay, anions away. Okay, that way, so this is going to receive these electrons, right? Oh, that's it. That's why we need bridge. That's right. So we have, okay, bridge like this one. Then if we have a bridge, then this sulfate anion is going to move. Okay, then, oh, this is going to be lonely. Then uh, this copper uh, cation is going to receive these electrons. That's it. Okay, look at this. Oh man, beautiful bridge, right? Inside the bridge, I just put what? Sodium sulfate salt. Okay, then uh, I we use some kind of plug right here. Okay, this one semi permeable. Uh, what is it? Porous, like a fabric or whatever, right? So only anions can go through. Okay, which is if we have extra SO4. Okay, but not yet something is happening right here so hey as soon as oh uh, one zinc oh uh, that's right zinc atoms gonna be zinc okay positive which we call oxidation right so two electrons produced so that's why uh oh so this one need uh some kind of a negative right which is girlfriend but no circuit here that's why i'm gonna put one light bulb there right now we have a circuit right here. Oh, then electron can go through this. Oh, that's it. Okay, just like this. Okay. Then automatically, oh, yes. Okay, through this bridge, this anions can go through. So SO4. Oh, that's it. So the left-hand side, we keep losing electrons. That's why, oh, that's right. So we call what? oxidation we gaining right hand side we gaining electron which is a reduction right so the right hand side the reduction start with r which is the consonant that's why cathode that's right okay which is a positive oh that's right cathode the left hand side oh that's right negative that's why this one is an anode right again to make sure okay so left hand side oxidation which is an anode okay so negative 
What about the right hand side? Reduction. R E D. Start with the R. So this one is a cathode. Okay. So positive side. Also oxidation. Why they call oxidation? You know what? Long time ago they start with oxidized means like oxygen with something. Like that's what we call rust, right? Oh man. Rust means what? They keep eating this. That's right. This metal. Oh, this is going to be empty, 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 uh, things like that. Ended up no more zinc. What, what about the right hand side? Oh, that's right. They keep receiving these electrons. Oh, that's right. Gaining electron. That's what we call reduction. Then, oh, so this is going to be what? Oh, that's right. So this is going to be reduced. So which is, okay, positive 2 cation is going to be zero okay so copper which is what oh that's right pure copper that's right build up more copper 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 around this one okay so now get the right hand side is getting bigger copper stick right so actually left hand side and right hand side we call this one so electrode okay anyway okay anode and cathode right so one is going out one is the keep building up oh up to what the point of used up okay so that's the problem so then no more light oh that's what oh that's right rechargeable battery came out oh we're gonna talk about rechargeable battery which is what the best one is what that's right car battery oh 